I've always felt, and I know that uh, Ruth always felt, that education was the number one thing. If people aren't educated or can't get educated because they have a learning disability or a speech problem, they're doomed. And she just felt that dedicating her life to that in teaching and working with children that had those disabilities was really important. And then when she finally passed away, what was left in her small estate was given to the school for scholarships. When I found out that I was a recipient of this award, it was mind-blowing, so exciting because I'm in my final semester now of graduate school. Also, you know, Ruth gave the scholarship. So not only do I have the benefit of meeting someone like John, whose aunt was doing exactly what I wanted to do years before me and putting things into practice so that other students could eventually continue that on, but she also set into notion the idea that if you're successful, keep giving back to people like me. Ruthie was not a wealthy person mm -hmm. by any stretch. And yet with the little money she had, she wanted to give back. You know, and when people earn money and they're successful, sometimes they get encouraged to donate to something or support something. But for somebody with little money to decide that she wants to give what she has back to the organization that helped create her opportunity with her education, I think that's a really big deal. It hits me really hard because it shows me that I'm following a path that's been set for me by other individuals, and we're continuing this legacy. Even though we haven't met before, I feel a connection to John because his aunt and I have a lot in common. We both were unified by this idea of we want to give back to children who have difficulties with communication. I don't care how much money you have, you can always give something. And if you can't afford a full scholarship, you could give partial scholarship. They're not looking for a large amount of money. They're not looking for personal support. So a little goes a long way and everybody can afford a little.